Hey everyone, it's Mallory with All About Cats. Um, this is Forrest. I know some of you guys have been asking about her, so I decided to bring her onto the set even though she's pretty camera shy and not really comfortable being taken away from her favorite spots. And then of course Wessie's behind us. So, um, if you're watching this on the day this video comes out, it is the last day of 2021. This year is coming to an end. And it's been a big one. Um, a bit winded from <laughs> trying to get Forrest um, and bring her over here. But yeah, um, 2021 has been a big year for All About Cats. Uh, the channel has grown a lot. Um, I've had the opportunity to try a lot of products. I've tried dozens of foods, toys, uh, treats. I've tried a lot of different uh, litter boxes and litter box accoutrements. So I've had the opportunity to try a lot of cat products, some of which were good, some of which were kind of mediocre, and some of which were really, really not that great at all. Um, so in this video, I wanted to talk to you about some of my favorites from this last year. Um, these are products that have kind of changed the way that I approach caring for Wessie and Forrest. And then some of them are products that for whatever reason I can't really use with them, but which I think really bring something new and valuable uh, to this marketplace and which I think are going to be really valuable for other people. So before I start talking about these products, I want to say thank you so much for being here uh, as a part of the All About Cats community. I really appreciate everyone who has subscribed and watched these videos and commented. It's really been an amazing experience getting to connect with all of you. Um, if you haven't already subscribed, it would be amazing if you could help us reach that 80,000 mark. Um, maybe before the end of the year. It, it seems a bit unlikely that it, we would get that many subscribers, but um, I would love for you to subscribe if, if you've been watching these videos and haven't already. Um, but otherwise, let's get into this video. So, the first product I want to talk about is a litter scoop. I talked about another litter scoop, the iPremio stainless steel scoop, in last year's best of the year video. Um, but this year I have one that I like even more, and it is the Litter Lifter. So if you've been in the cat community for a while, you've probably heard of the Litter Lifter. I recently started using it, and it really does live up to all of the hype. This is a big plastic litter scoop with nice parallel tines, and this design that allows it to just fly through litter. It really does zip through the litter and enables you to scoop without shaking. Uh, I'm really pleased with it. So that would be my number one kind of life-changing cat product of the year. You can purchase it on Amazon for $9.19 currently. The next product that kind of changed my life in 2021 uh, also relates to the litter box and it is the Purified Air. So the Purified Air is a litter box specific little air purifier. You can either mount it on top of a covered litter box or use the included wall bracket to put it above an open litter box. And this little purifier contains multiple compounds intended to eradicate litter box odor specifically and then it has a little fan. And this combination works really, really well. It's a pretty simple device, but it does its job excellently. I noticed uh, an instant reduction in litter box odor. Obviously, it's important for me as a reviewer to know how well uh, all of these types of cat litter work, um, but I found that just in my regular uh, life with cats, um, this purifier helps to cut down on odor. So overall, I would highly recommend the Purified Air if you really want to get rid of litter box odor. Another side note is that uh, while we are not in an affiliate program with Purified Air directly, I've spoken with Bob, uh, the guy who runs the company. He's very nice to work with, and I have a lot of appreciation for the way that he treats customers and um, even interacts with me. So it, it seems like a very nice company um, from nice people. So that's always a bonus and something I wanted to mention about this company. So if you're interested in trying the Purified Air, it's going to cost $139.99. Um, remember that you can get lifetime fan replacements from the company, which is really nice. Um, definitely something worth checking out if you want to control litter box odor a little bit better. The third product I was really impressed by is the Nekoichi Extra Wide Elevated Cat Bowl. So, um, I don't necessarily think that elevated bowls are necessary for encouraging good posture. Cats naturally crouch when they eat. Um, 
and we don't really have any you know, controlled studies or anything showing that that type of more upright posture is better for eating. But what I like about this bowl is that it's very well made and uh, has a very attractive design that can really, well, elevate your uh, cat feeding area. It's made from porcelain, it's going to be more hygienic for your cat, and overall it's just a nice way to um, make your cat's dining experience a little bit more chic. Um, so you can purchase this Nekoichi bowl for $19.99 on Amazon. The fourth product that I've been really enjoying over the last year is the K&H Thermo Kitty bed. I have it sitting here behind me. Wessie's not using it right now because it's not in his normal space. Neither of the cats really like coming into this room. Um, but ever since the cold weather has set in this year, Wessie has been in this bed almost constantly. Uh, it heats up to a little bit higher than your cat's natural body temperature and it really keeps them nice and warm and toasty. We know that cats love warmth and this bed really delivers on it. Uh, so I would highly recommend this bed, especially to people with maybe senior cats who have some joint issues and also anyone who lives in a colder climate. It's a really nice uh, bed that can keep your cat warm. So currently this bed is priced at uh, $53.99 on Amazon. The next few products are things that I'm not really using actively, they just don't really fit into my lifestyle, but they really stood out to me from the competition. So the first is the Kitty Sift Disposable Sifting Litter Box. So I first found out about the Kitty Sift earlier this year. I was contacted by the company's owner, Carrie, and she told me about this disposable sifting litter box. It's a cardboard box, you sift to clean out the litter, and then you throw it away after about a month or so. And it's a really cool concept for a few reasons. Um, it solves the common problems that we're facing with sifting litter boxes, which is that the waste gets stuck in those little uh, holes through which the litter is intended to sift. By using this disposable format, you're able to throw it away or compost it if you have appropriate facilities for that and not have to deal with that built up gunk. Obviously, a disposable litter box is not going to be for everyone, but I can see this being a really useful option if you're fostering cats, if you have a cat for whatever reason temporarily, or even if you are leaving your cat with a sitter. Another nice thing about this litter box is that that cardboard is really attractive to cats for some reason. Wessie loved it. I've heard about a lot of other cats who just feel really drawn to this cardboard. And so this can also be a good option for cats who are having some litter box aversion. You need to attract your cat to the litter box. So the Kitty Sift is available on the Kitty Sift store for $19.99. The sixth product that I want to talk about is the GeoBit Tracker. So you might remember our second video ever was on cat trackers. We're planning on coming out with a new roundup of all of the best cat trackers on the market. Um, but of the trackers I've tried in this year, the GeoBit is one that combines a number of features that I'm not seeing in many other cat trackers on the market. What I mean by that is it offers both Bluetooth and GPS tracking technology, which means that you can keep track of your cat in the house and you can also keep track of them outdoors. And it's also pretty lightweight weight. It's a little bit on the bigger side um, for cats, uh, but my cat Forest seemed to feel pretty comfortable wearing it, and I know that it's gotten pretty good reviews from other cat owners. Another really nice thing about the GeoBit Tracker is that it learns your cat's activity patterns and is able to preserve battery life based on that. So by doing that, it has a longer battery life than most other GPS trackers, which are notorious for not having enough battery life to stay powered if your cat uh, has gone missing. So that's a really nice uh, benefit of this tracker as well. Again, we'll be coming out with a roundup of all of the best cat trackers. I haven't tried all of them yet, so I might end up ranking some other trackers a bit higher than this one. But for now, I really like the combination of technologies I'm seeing in the GeoBit tracker and I would uh, recommend it as a good option for those of you who have maybe indoor outdoor cats or are really concerned about your cat escaping and you want to have a little bit of a better ability to track them. The GeoBit tracker costs $89.99 for the tracking unit and then you're going to pay upwards of $8.99 per month for the service. 
My second to last favorite product of the year is the Sleepy Pod Cat Harness. So I've tried a lot of cat harnesses over the years and a lot of them have their flaws. Some of them are kind of uncomfortable. Some of them are really easy to escape from. And the Sleepy Pod Martingale Harness for Cats combines pretty much everything we're looking for in a cat harness in one really nicely designed package. I have a lot of respect for the Sleepy Pod brand in general. They offer some really good cat carriers and their harness is similarly well designed. I really liked the martingale adjustment that allows it to kind of tighten up slightly when you your cat reaches the end of the leash. This is the most common time for cats to be able to escape from the harness and so it provides a little bit of extra security there and the mesh design makes it really nice and lightweight and comfortable. Overall it's a really good harness. Uh, I have found that it's no longer in stock on Amazon, at least for the time being. And for a while it was out of stock on the Sleepy Pod site, but I just checked and it is in stock there. So if you would like to try out this harness, it costs $26.99 in the Sleepy Pod store. The last product I want to talk about is one that I just started using, which is the feeder robot. So this is an automatic feeder coming from Whisker, the company behind the litter robot. And what I like about it is that while it's not uh, going to be right for the most species appropriate of diets, as we know, cats need moisture in their food, and dry food is ultimately kind of nutrient deficient. It's deficient in water. But if you are going to feed your cat dry food, an automatic feeder can be really helpful for freeing up your schedule, allowing you to give your cat multiple meals uh, throughout the day. It can be a really good option for controlling your cat's portion sizes as well. What I like about the feeder robot as opposed to other automatic cat feeders I've tried is its combination of features. So you are able to have full adjustability and control over your timed feeding. So you're able to schedule feedings all through the day and you're able to adjust the portion size as well. Uh, all of this is controllable either on the unit or through the Feeder Robots app, which gives you an additional level of control and ability to monitor your cat's feedings. Another neat feature of this feeder is that it has a gravity feed feature. So you are able to have it automatically fill the bowl every time that it gets a bit low, uh, which is neat. Like a lot of the other products on this list, this comes from a company that I respect. It, this company has a deep background in developing really well-engineered cat products. And so uh, the feeder robot seems like a very well-designed, well-constructed automatic feeder uh, for people who feed their cats dry food. So if that's you, definitely one worth considering. The feeder robot costs $249. So that's about it for my list of favorite products of 2021. As always, all the links to these products will be located in the description. So let me know in the comments, what were your favorite products of the year? Um, did you try any of the recommendations from the All About Cats channel? Were you happy with them? Um, I don't know. I would love to hear your feedback and thoughts on reflections on the last year, products you tried with your cat, experiences you had with your cat. It's just a good time to reflect on the last year and make plans for the next one. And on that note, please let me know if you have any ideas for 2022. Let me know what kind of content you liked over the last year. I know we've added in a lot of new things. We started working with Dr. Sarah Wooten and now she's doing these health topics once a week. Uh, we've done a, a lot of new cat food brand reviews and started doing lab testing on these foods. So I have a lot of ideas for how we can do more in the next year, but I would love to hear your feedback, what you've liked, uh, what you haven't liked, and what you would like to see more of in the future. So again, as always, um, thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate all of you, especially those of you who have left comments. Oh. As always, thank you so much for being here. Um, I really appreciate all of you who have subscribed, who thumbs up, who just watch the videos without interacting, um, but especially those of you who have left comments um, really means a lot. So thank you so much. and. Here's to 2022. <laughs> All right. Um, hope to see you next year. Bye.